Hello, my name is Voya and welcome to my deep guide. This is going to be a series of how to tutorials, how to best maximize your remarkable one or two paper tablet. One of the features that I really like that was implemented recently for the Remarkable platform is the uh, Chrome extension which is called Read on Remarkable and it's really easy to set up and once you set it up it can be shown here as a little shortcut here and then you can actually configure it. One of the things that's kind of cool is that it can uh, send the document in two different uh, ways. First is a simplified as a text file which can be formatted so no images no nothing like that but just this or send as a PDF. So for example I can simply click here and the article is going to be converted to text and sent to my Remarkable directly and then I can just go through text and kind of see okay all of these things are good or not and because it's converted to text it's basically like an EPUB so if it's small enough you can uh, relatively quickly adjust these things the formatting and everything so that it um, fits uh, everything nicely so let's just make this a little bit more narrow so that it does not interfere with the uh, toolbar here and then you can go through the document itself and then maybe just go and say like okay these things I don't like and then you can just say like make better or something and once you're done with the editing of or reviewing of a document or a web page or whatever it is that you may have uh, been checking out or an article uh, then you can further on send it as an email and you can use uh, whatever email you want you can add a message you can customize normally like do you want to send all of the pages or just some of the pages so for example this is an empty one so I don't want to send that I can just confirm and then I can go add message correct this this now right so very super friendly and awesome and then you can just simply confirm and I can set the file name to be corrected right and I can just confirm and send as a PDF or images click send you wait a little bit and you'll get a little notification there we go file sent and then once you're done actually you check your email and this is the document that you get and it's clearly marked and yeah everything pretty much works normally. For me, this is a very productive way of using these things. Uh, however, one of the things that would be really, really amazing is if we could finally have the color strikes. And of course, I'm not talking about displaying colors on a monochrome device, no. I'm talking about the ability to actually use uh, blue, green, red, orange, or whatever. It's still gonna display black, but when I go back to the document here, it's not gonna be black, but it's gonna be in blue, red, orange, yellow, or whatever color that I chose. I think for marking things up, it would be a very, very cool thing um, to have, especially in this use case scenario, where it actually transforms it into a very, very productive uh, tool. Of course, I would also immediately move this to the correct folder, and I think this would be a nice thing if the uh, extension had the ability to actually, since it's already connected, Connected with your account to have the ability where to send the converted documents to so that I don't have to move them that they are actually automatically go into my read on remarkable folder that would make it even a step further more productive but yeah I mean wishful thinking I guess but it would be a very nice thing one more thing that you can do is also um, I can right click and go print or send to remarkable and then you send to remarkable you can choose an option as a printer and then when i click print this is now going to actually convert it and send as a pdf with all the images and everything like that so this is not going to convert it to text this is going to be a pdf itself and you will have the ability to review all the images and all that kind of stuff if that's what you you're looking for and then you can just say move this over here uh, don't use this image and then you can just say like uh, mention this that and blah 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 and then again once you're actually done you can do the same thing and you can send it by email 
email. So overall, this is how I like to actually use the read on remarkable feature because it's uh, makes it very, very useful. And because you have the ability to send by email, it is a productive tool. So it's something that's really, really cool. I just wish that it could, um, that we had the color uh, strokes and that I can set up the default folder where I want the files to go to. But yep, this is basically a productive way how to use read on remarkable extension on Chrome. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please like and subscribe and see you next time. Bye.